Mitch is holding a very small textbook from one of her classes, a blank expression on her face. This cost $300. $300. And it's used. I, I can't I just. I, oh, shit. Well, there goes half the funds mom and dad gave me for the semester. The first week of college is done, and what an interesting week it was. It's very weird not to have to wake up at 6 in the morning for eight continuous hours of education in the same building every single weekday. And to not go home after class is over, but to a cramped dorm room where I watch Matt clip his toenails and marathon reruns of Golden Girls on Hulu. I do not watch Golden Girls. Don't even lie, man. You totally do. You can shut your stupid face, nerd who plays Dungeons and Dragons. Okay, I played it once when I was 10. Anyway, I managed to get some footage on my iPod so you can see what campus looks like and everything. We had a brief montage of the various buildings on campus, and while Mitch is showing us the student center, someone grabs Mitch's wrist and shoves the focus onto themselves. <coughs> Making a movie, Mitch? Hey, Jason. Uh, no, it's for Quentin. I'm just doing a vlog thing. No way. Are you gonna be, an, are you gonna be internet famous? Can I be your sidekick? I. I highly doubt I'm going to be famous, but you can still be my sidekick if you want. Hey Bruce, Mitch is going to be a YouTube star. I'm not going to... She's what? I'm just making some dumb thing. It's really no big deal. What is it? It's a video blog about my freshman year. I'm going to be recording the stuff that happens to me. Wait, so you're going to be filming stuff all year? Yeah, that's the plan. Oh man, I definitely need to be in these, like, all the time. Are you going to film Rush? What? You're joining, you're joining one of the sororities, right? Nobody told me about any sorority. What? Well, you got to join because we're joining the frat and you got to get us in with the ladies. Yeah, Jason's got to have a whole new stock of chicks to choose from. <laughs> and we're finally going to get Mitch a girlfriend. That's my personal mission this year. Oh, ha. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to turn this off now. I swear, Jason thinks everyone is able to get girls as easily as he does. He just dumps them all like they mean nothing. Well, that's not fair. I mean, he's been pretty upset about having to break up with that girl he was dating in California. That's exactly what I fucking mean. Ever since he's moved back here from California, he's just been going through girls and he's trying to break a world record. What the hell gives him the right to drop people like that? I can't stand it with assholes like him. Just treat people like they're... Fucking disposable. Uh, yeah, you do have a point, I guess. But I think it's it, because... It's like they don't even care who they hurt. They just string you along for months or years or whatever. And then snap of the fingers and go on. Okay, what's going on? I have never heard you rag on Jason's dating habits like this before. Holly broke up with me. What? When? Why? Two weeks ago. She said it was just a summer thing. It was time for her to move on or something. I don't even fucking know. Man, that fucking sucks, Matt. I'm sorry. Well, I guess the humiliation is compounded by the fact that you're gonna put this on the internet for everyone to see. I, I can take this part out. Yeah, <coughs> Quentin doesn't need to know about any of this. But since I'm on a roll, I might as well tell the rest of the world, the rest of my sad story to the world. About an hour after my girlfriend broke up with me, my parents told me they're getting divorced. Oh my, are you serious? Yep. I guess they were just waiting for me to move out before they did it. Matt, I, I don't even know what to say. Worst week ever. Well, back to homework. And you can leave all this in if you want. Okay. <laughs>